So what are we up to today, Karen? All right, so today, um, not all adventures are in a mountain or, <laughs> you know, riding our bikes. Today we're working in the yard. We started building this fence out back here. We saw it, we saw similar fences when we were out on the road. A little more finished probably than this one is, but um, we had a lot of blowdowns in the yard, so we started working that. We pretty much cleaned up the blowdowns, but as you can see, we have to finish. Yeah, the fence is not done. Yard here. So now we so we got some dead trees in the woods. We just, and we are definitely not lumberjacks. <laughs> no, we just, just took this, this one, one down. down. Yeah, it was nice and dead, and it's nice and straight, so we should get a few lengths out of that. Um, so we're gonna have to yank this out and cut it up. We got a couple more trees we wanna. We get targeted for today. So this is the tree we took down. We just dragged it out of the woods. Now we're going to cut it into some lengths to use for the fence. All right. So one time cutting the single length. We didn't feel totally comfortable cutting down some of the standing dead stuff so we don't want to take a chance on doing something dangerous so now we're out in our backyard out in the woods and there's a lot of fallen stuff so we're pretty sure we're gonna find enough right out here this one here we're gonna start working on okay we cut one. so we cut up a bunch of pieces now we're putting the fence together we just did these sections here so we're just all we're doing is lining them up screwing them in with drywall screws to make each section. Yeah, we don't we even screw little, every one. Yeah, yeah, we just, so basically we're just doing, it's just decorative. The fence is obviously just, it's only a couple feet high. And um, just to separate the yard here out in the back where we have a bunch of stumps that were left in when they cleared the land. So we're just gonna let that grow up with this grass that's out here. Probably, we're gonna try and get some wildflowers growing out here. Yeah, so this is just a separation. So where we mow the lawn and where we do. Ready? Yep. Okay. That's easy as that. Yeah. Got a fire crank in here for all the uh, stuff. We got so much stuff down around the edges of the yard here. We could be burning wood forever. Got a whole bunch over there in the wheelbarrow. Ready to go. We got a fire pit over here too we use. So <laughs> every time you come out, there's a reason to go yeah. some debris to get rid of. This is what we mow, and that's what we mow with. Push mower. Right, Carol? Yep. Ten miles, right? Ten miles a day. You can skip your daily workout. Yeah, you can walk. You get to walk ten miles when you mow this lawn. So that's how we do it. So we're heading back out in the woods. I figure we need 13 more pieces. I don't know if we'll find it or not gonna rain what well, we got maybe an hour and a half or so before it starts raining and while we were out here looking in the woods earlier we saw a bunch of maple trees that we're gonna mock so we can tap them in the spring so we've been doing that the last couple of seasons last year not so good but we got a few maples out here we don't have any sugar maples they're all I think they're probably black but anyway it doesn't matter we still get maple syrup out of them. So we're going to go out here and see if we can find them and well, that one's already mark them. Out. We got some that we had already marked before. The paint wears off, so but if we know if they have the little wood block on it, it's a maple. Because once the leaves fall off, you can't really tell. All right, so yeah, we should look up at the leaves and see maple leaves. All right. So it's raining now. The rain came sooner than we expected. So we got, we still need eight more. Oh, actually six more pieces because we got the bottom one down. Yeah. yeah, so we need six more pieces and that's it. But that'll have to be for another day. Take a little view from the little further out here. Yeah, so we get the fence starting there all the way across the backyard. We've got two more sections to complete. And then we're done with our not so fancy fence, but we like it.